Michael Nagy here with Jiggy Jag TV, and today I'm here with Giovanni, owner of Sex Work PR. How are you doing? I am doing fantastic, Nagy. How are you doing today? Great. It's great to have you. Awesome convention, having a blast. Yeah. And tell us about how did you get into this whole lifestyle? Oh my God. Well, first off, it was a very long story, but it started off helping out a cam model that my wife and I knew that she needed to build out her MFC profile page. And that was down in the Houston area. And then what happened was like one thing leads to another, everybody starts talking, I'm doing all that. And it sort of morphed. I couldn't, and next thing you know, I'm doing public relations, marketing, advertising, media, now agency as well. And I work with Jiggy Jag TV's people uh, for the content side of it. I know you guys got the interview stuff, like you, Nagy, great work. But also with Jiggy, it's, uh, you know, we shoot, the con we shoot the content the fans want to see, porn. Good old fashioned American made porn. <laughs> So thank you, but yeah, so it's a, it's a whole lot. It's been a long journey, and I'm happy to be here. And tell us about the booth you got here today. Well, Sex Work PR is uh, obviously what we've done today is a little bit different of a model than a lot of booths do. We got models that are coming in, and they go in for various shifts at a time. And what happens is they come in for a few hours, and they get to go back to the hotel and make art, and then they come back again. And so that way we rotate different models at different times, and also to be respectful of their schedules. We've had models who are actually rotating through another booth at the same time. And this is great for both of us. And so we partnered with other booths to tell them, hey, your model can be here, then we can be over there. And it has worked out phenomenally well. I would think that this is a, a fantastic way to do it. It helps us, it helps all the companies, and it just helps out the models in general, which you know is what we're for. We're all about the models. How many models would you say you work with about? Oh God, I'm in I'm in the 20s at this point. You know, wow. I mean, it's it's been a while. You know, it, it took a while to get to that number, but you know what? It's it's a fantastic. I wouldn't have it any other way. I would. And we're doing what you're doing with PR. How does somebody get into that who uh, is new to this whole industry? Uh, you know what? That's a very interesting question, Nagy, because I actually we actually had earlier today. I, I shit you not. Uh, there was a girl who looked like she could have been in business college. Uh, she came up with a. A fucking resume over here to this booth, and there I was, and she was like, "Hey, you know, I want, I want to say, but I, 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 they, they got me because they're like, hey, this girl's asking about, you know, she want to get in, she wants to. I thought she meant she wanted to, you know, make the movies, and so I walk up there and said, "Hey, how you doing?" You know, and she goes, "Oh no, I, I don't want to be in the sex work. I want to be in the PR part of it." And I brought my resume, and and apparently her and her guy watched porn. They saw her name, and we saw we were going to be at the booth. She come dressed like a business interview. <laughs> I mean, I thought it was fucking phenomenal. Like, I mean, I'm like, that, yeah, she was like, oh, what do you need? And she goes, well, I just kind of want an internship. I said, our internships do not pay. She goes, no, that's cool. I, you know, I just want to learn this side of the business. So I was like, holy shit, we've got an intern. So we're going to definitely be ramped up for Chicago in 2025. Is that your next event then? That is the next event. Uh, well, that is the next booth event, Nagy. That's a great question. Uh, because it's more about, for us, we use the Chicago show and the New Jersey show are kind of our pillar shows. We don't do any exhibits otherwise. When we go to AVN, we go as media. And as, well, you're familiar with that with Jiggy Jack TV. And then when we go to XBIS, it's only for professional development. That's kind of what we go there for. So that's kind of the mix. Now today, do you have any memorable experiences so far you want to share? You know what? You know we're shooting content uh, while well, we're making art in the room, and I, I think one of the uh, one of the funny parts of that was that I, I, we talked about this. Ex this has come up a few times. It's a fascinating world because what happens is you're in a business where it's not normal conversations that every other business has. Like I'm sitting there. Just going through paperwork, and I hear, "What what color ball gag do you prefer?" And it escaped me for that small pocket when I was just going through forms. Then I heard that, and I forgot. Oh yeah, we've got we got some work going on over here. There's about to be a bondage stuff happening, and so it was like, "Holy shit!" I, I laughed my ass off because I was like, "In no other job." <laughs> right. Or are you gonna hear, hey, uh, what kind of ball gag do you like over there? Which color? So it's been one of those things. Oh, cool. Well, I love the convention. Great having you here. Talk with you. Great to have you part of the channel. Look him up. Sex Work PR. At Sex Work PR on Twitter. At G I L V on Twitter. SexWorkPR.com. Come on, join us.
That's right.